Good morning, it's Huang with Hands-On Therapy Services. Oh, let me sit up straight. I'm sitting here slouching. I know that a lot of people do. Um, and it's okay every once in a while, it's okay. As long as you remember to sit straight up um, when, when you feel like you've been slouching. I mean, we're not perfect, right? None of us are. There's gonna be times when we slouch. That wasn't the whole point of me coming on here to talk. I just noticed that I was slouching, so I wanted to correct myself and um, thought you could do that too. But anyway, it is bright and early here at Hands-On Therapy Services, and um, we're just getting ready. I've got my coffee in hand um, and getting the clinic ready for the first um, client to come in this morning. And it just um, made me think about this conversation I was having with a friend of mine and um, I pay attention you know I pay attention when uh, when I talk to people and um, and I just wanted to share um, this one thing so I was talking to a friend of mine and he was talking about some of his like health issues you know and he wanted to he, he like knows he should go to the doctor for these health issues but at the same time, he's um, he's thinking, why you know, um, why go? Because I know that um, it's just the news is not going to be good. And we were talking about this because I often find that people who come to me, who come and talk to our specialists here at Hands On Therapy Services, they've waited a little while. Like we have someone coming in. Um, later today that you know has been having um you know pain in in like the upper back part you know of um their body and it's a little bit hard to pinpoint because they're like well i don't feel like it's my neck and i don't feel like it's my shoulders but i've got this weird pain somewhere back there and um it's uh you know it's kind of irritating her when she works right um but not too much not really um what really bothers her what is when she goes to sleep you know she can't get comfortable it feels really tight it feels really achy and at times there can be sharp pain but um she just hasn't really made much of an effort to do anything until the pain got a little bit worse and so she finally went to the doctor and she got some done and nothing they're like oh it's nothing uh, it's probably just muscle and so you know when I think about people who come and tell me like I know something is wrong I'm just you know scared not scared scared isn't necessarily the word they just don't want to get bad news right like who the hell wants to get bad news um, that you know if I go to the doctor they might find something wrong and I don't want to make a decision uh, when it comes to something that's wrong. Like I'm waiting for my first um, client to get here this morning and he was in an accident, broke a bunch of things, had to have surgery. There's no decision there, like he needs to come in for therapy. The decision is like where? Where do I go for the best therapy? Where do I go for the best possible results? Um, because something bad has already happened. But when it's, um, when you don't know, right? When you don't know exactly what it is, um, it can be a little bit, you know, a little bit of that, um, I don't wanna know because what if it's bad news? Well, I want to try to change that around for you because um, we've been helping more and more people with um, some of those annoying aches that just won't go away. You know, when you feel tight here all the time, um, we've been helping people with this little stabbing pain in the back or maybe it's in the neck or maybe it's in the arm. Um, and it's not stopping them from doing anything. It's definitely slowing them down and it's taking a, a, a part of their brain, right? It's taking space in a part of your brain and it is worrying you. So, you know, they're worried, well, what if this gets worse? What if now 
it's sort of slowing me down from playing my tennis, but what if it gets worse to the point where I can't play tennis? Um, what if, you know, I'm taking care of my, my wife or my kids and um, what if it gets worse and um, I can't take care of them anymore, right? Um, and so the, the worry and the thought is, uh, tends to be very negative. And so what if it's, you know, bad news? Well, I'm here to tell you, what if it's really good news, right? What if it's really good news? So somebody I was talking to and she was like, so she was worried about it. It's been occupying a space in her brain for about a year. It's been bothering her for about a year. And finally it was starting to get worse. So she was like, I'm gonna go to the doctor, find out what's wrong. And she had a sigh of relief. <sighs> okay, nothing is, you know, nothing's broken. I don't have to have surgery. But then the doctor was like, well, nothing is wrong. So you get the news that nothing is wrong, but something is really so wrong because you still have that pain back there. You still have that like achiness back there or that tightness back there and you still can't sleep, right? The good news, right? Let's switch our brain here a little bit. The good news is that a lot of times, you know, we use our bodies so much every day, all day, and then sometimes there's just a little imbalance, right? And it can actually be quite easy to find out what that imbalance is. You know, you can come here to Hands On Therapy Services and we will do uh, a test head to toe to try to take a look at what's going on right what's going wrong where's the imbalance get to the root cause of it give you clarity in terms of what you need to do next and um, we take the guess work out of it so we're gonna get you clear on what's wrong so we can help you get the right kind of help right so the right kind of help is very individualized a lot of times people come to me and they're like well how often do I need to come how often do you want to come you know how, what is the priority of you being able to fix the problem that you have? Because a lot of times, you know, people think of uh, physical therapy, occupational therapy as like having to come multiple we uh, days a week, multiple months, forever. And that's not always the case. When you're having some aches and pains and you get to it early, uh, the great news is that we can find out where the imbalance is, give you some clarity and get you the right help. So it's not as time consuming. It's not as time consuming as having to come here for tons and tons of visits, right? That's the good news. And the good news is if you're as committed as I am committed to helping you, then it doesn't need to be this long drawn out thing. And it doesn't need to um, be the, uh, well, we'll see what happens. I'm not really sure, right? We can really dive in, get to the root cause of it. And so the whole um, point of this story that I want to impress upon you is, you know, can we change the question that we're asking ourselves? Like, um, you know, how bad is this gonna be? But really the question we say, how good is this gonna be? How good is it? How um, great is it that the problem isn't that bad yet and that we could actually solve it for you um, and tell you exactly what's wrong, give you clarity in terms of what's wrong and give, get you the right kind of help so it doesn't keep taking up uh, brain space, it doesn't keep worrying you and it allows you to be able to do a little bit more, sleep a little bit better, um, just feel better so you can be happier and actually sit up. <laughs> All right, you guys, that is it for today. And I hope that it helps you to think instead of thinking about what is wrong, like the negative, you know, what can we think? What can we do to think like uh, what is a positive and what can we do right now to help it? If you are worried and you just want to know a little bit, um, was, visit our website, Hands On Therapy. Serve, oh, well, it's www.handsots.com. Um, I'll include it in the links available to you. Get started there. Um, check out our YouTube channel. There's a bunch of videos that I've created, 
and um, that can talk to you about your specific thing. And listen, if I haven't created it yet, let me know. And I will talk about that for you um, to give you some clarity in terms of what it could be so that you can get the right kind of help for you. All right, so we can start there first. Um, but if you're someone who's a little bit more ready um, that we here at Hands-On Therapy Services can help you, then give us a call here at 786-615-9879. I'll, I'll include that in the links for you too. Make it easy for you.